stars on the show was Magenta, played by Patricia Quinn. She joins us now from London. Good morning, Patricia. Uh, good morning, Sonia and David. When Rocky Horror first opened, it wasn't an instant success, but it now has an international cult following. So what was it about this film that made it such a classic? It's just wonderful. <laughs> and it's about sex, drugs and rock and roll, and that's always a good thing. It was great, great fun. And also what's really in particular is that it is now um, the longest running film in cinema history. We've made history. It's a massive accomplishment. They, they used to screen Rocky Horror at midnight in New York after it was released, and then fans became soon obsessed. They dressed up like the stars for the screenings. Were you surprised by that hype? Well, that was astonishing because Michael White, one of the producers of the film, uh, called us in London and said they're talking to your film and they're dressing up as you. And we thought, well, this is utterly mad because this had never happened before, ever. And then we went to New York um, to see this amazing event happening. It was, a, it was just astonishing. This had never happened in cinema, ever. And this guy's mother said, oh, my son plays Frank. I make his costumes, he gets arrested every weekend, but I get him out. And then we went, I said, yeah. And then they said to me at the Q&A, they said, uh, Miss Quinn, did you make the movie so slow so we could talk to it? And I said, of course we did. I love that. You also starred alongside Tim Curry and Susan Sarandon. They were little known actors back then. What was the dynamic like working on set? And did you all immediately have that chemistry that we see on the screen? You no, know, the extraordinary thing is that uh, actually Tim, Nell and myself and Richard had done it, been on the stage at the um, Royal Court Theatre. So thank goodness Jim Sharman, the director, he got Fox to keep us unknowns at the time. Um, and then Susan and Barry Boswick came in from America and Meatloaf had already played it on the stage in Los Angeles. So it was a great jumping off ground and we were just a wonderful mix in a melting pot. Now, of course, you played the role of Magenta, known for that famous red lips and this iconic movie line. Let's just have a, a walk back down memory lane. You're lucky. He's lucky. I'm lucky. We're See, that's great. Now, I mean, would you say those lines for us again right now? You're lucky. He's lucky. I'm lucky. We're all lucky. See? Yeah, yeah. that was fantastic. That has made our morning. But looking back over the last 40 years, what would you say is your fondest memory of the Rocky Horror Picture Show? I think it's talking to you now. <laughs> that I'm still here talking about it. That's stunning. And next month, I'm opening the Albert Hall. I know it's been open for a very long time, but on the 27th of October, I'm opening it for the Rocky Horror Picture Show. We just loved having you on this morning, Patricia. Thank you. Thank you. You're a darling. Thanks awfully.